Hi everyone, welcome back to Animal Wonders. I'm Jessie. Today we're not at Animal Wonders, we're actually at the vet and I'm here with Mariah. Hi, I'm a board member and I've been working with Gaia for a couple of months and I'm excited to finally be doing this today. So Gaia is a three-banded armadillo and Mariah has been working with her for months now, training her for a voluntary ultrasound so we can see what's going on inside her. She has been housed with Kincho, our male three-banded armadillo, for two years and nothing has happened. It's, we don't know what's happening. That's why we're doing this. We wanna see what's going on, see if, if she is growing a baby, um, that'd be neat. Um, and if not, then we have more information. Yeah. All right, so we're about ready to head back into the room and we're gonna bring you behind the scenes so you can see how this works. Sorry. <laughs> We've got Gaia here. She's in her crate. No supplies. Here's the ultrasound machine. Hi, Dr. Card. Hello. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. <laughs> Should I go? You can stay in here. You have the food. So, Mariah, what are you setting up right now? Right now, we're setting up her little exercise pen so we can contain Gaia. And I try and do the same thing every time so she knows what to expect. Target stick, just in case. Eucalyptus, she likes that scent. And we put the eucalyptus on there just so she can smell it. Oh, the target stick a little bit better. Um, and it's, it's just helps her really focus in. They have terrible eyesight, but their sense of smell is really heightened. And so adding that scent in there really does help. And then this was specially made. This is her little like perch <laughs> um, station area. Um, and you'll see exactly how that works. What we did last time was let her, let her out, she'll have to wake up. Um, let her run around a little bit, sniff, and then maybe we'll do one perch okay. first for practice. I'll give her one little worm and then I think she'll hop right back up again. Okay. Good morning. Hi, Gaia. Hi, baby. Hi. It usually takes her a minute to wake up. You can see her little nose moving. Yeah. You want to maybe wake up? There she is. Good morning. <coughs> So cute. Hi, Gaia. What do you think? Good girl. Really good. Good. Good girl. Really good. Where's where do you think her motivation is? <laughs> Um, I'm thinking we could try. I think we I could try it. Worry about like balancing that satiation and and willingness. Like we're right there. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think she's Girl. offering. Good job. Good girl. I think we could probably try it. Yeah. Okay. Um, you tell me when. Good girl. I'd say go for it. Yeah. Right. There we go. Good girl. Boop, 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 boop. It's okay. Good girl. Good girl. Good 
good girl, Kaya. Nice job. Okay, we're gonna put some worms in. Good girl. Really good. Good girl. Whoop, 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 whoop. It's okay. It's okay. I didn't see a baby there. Okay. Would you think she that was bad. a good enough look? That was a good look. Okay. Do you okay. want to try it one more time? We or? could try it one more time. It wasn't too bad, huh? Still good okay. girl. Yeah. Yeah, okay. We'll do it again. Good girl. That was not Very too scary. good. Here we go. Put your feet down. <laughs> nice job. Really good. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, I am not good seeing girl. the baby there. Good girl. Okay. No baby. Okay. Okay. <laughs> now we know. Well, that was exciting. That was a awesome. success. <laughs> Maria, good job. That was awesome. <laughs> She's such, oh, somebody good got girl. goo on Here you go. Tummy. Here you go. There's some freebies. Good job. Really good. Good job, Gaia. Have you ever done an ultrasound with an armadillo before? Nope. <laughs> what do you what did you think about when we're like hey we'd like to do this what did you think about it it's well the the whole the you know having your stand up so, because the whole point is to be able to get at her little tummy when in the past when we had to like look at the male and and look at his tummy he rolled himself up in a little ball and you couldn't really see anything it was really hard to work on him so this was great. I was really impressed with um, how how much effort Mariah put into every little step because you know, Guy didn't just have to go up onto this perch here. She also had to have someone touch her belly, but then put all that pressure on there. And we hadn't gotten to the the wet slimy stuff yet. So that was the first. This is I have second. Time. No, we didn't do any wet slimy stuff um, when we did our practice. Um, time here, but I had been dipping it in water a okay. little. So yeah. I had been using the target stick and just touching her, but I had not applied as much pressure. So that was that was new for her today. It's the very first yeah. time. Mm -hmm. Guy has given us the only gift that she can give us. Yeah, that means she's really comfortable. She's, she's awake. <laughs> she's happy. <Yeah. laughs> Things are moving. <laughs> It also really shows when an animal goes to the bathroom and it's not loose. That really just indicates that they are not stressed. Um, so this was a very easy peasy thing for her. She's just gotten so used to doing it so much. And... Gaia, you did great! We're all so proud of you! <laughs> so that happened. Yep. That, that was amazing. I mean, I knew she was going to do it because I've seen you, how, how hard you've been working on it. How did you feel? Um, I was nervous. Um, <laughs> she does such a good job in her environment and with all the predictable things. And so I was a really, I was a little nervous about the new um, setting, mm -hmm. but she did a great job. You have been preparing her for this though. You've done it in multiple different areas. You've done it um, with different people around, different sounds around. Um, and she's just, every time she's just so resilient. Um, I think she was a little sleepy. Yeah. So the warm up was a little slow, but yep. by the end she had it. She was trucking by the end. She yep. was like zooming around. <laughs> and so now we know that she doesn't have a baby, mm -hmm. which is kind of what I was expecting. Were, were you kind of hoping that she would have a baby or, or what? How'd you feel about um, it? I was fine with either outcome. Yeah. I just wanted it to be a successful uh, procedure. Um, so their gestation is 125 days. And so, um, at about 120 days, we'll do this again and just see what's going on. Um, and the reason that we want to make sure that they're, you know, we know what's going on is um, we don't want her to have a baby and have Kinchu in the same area because sometimes the males can be aggressive towards the babies. So if we do see a baby growing inside, uh, we can separate her and Kinchu. So this was not only an exercise in training for and practice for Mariah. She trains dogs um, professionally. She's amazing. Um, but this is your first armadillo. This is my first armadillo <laughs> training. <laughs> so it was really good for Mariah to do this. It was great for Gaia, um, but also you know making sure that we're taking care of them to the best of our ability as well. Awesome. We did it. Awesome. We did it. Yay. <laughs> All right. Thank you for joining us. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.